What's going on, dickweeds? I'm still smoking Baby Yoda OG from Cannabismo. It's real good. Just saying. Hey. Um. Um. You might hear some static. The heat's going. It's cold as fuck outside. Anyway, let's get the show on the road, eh? Let's get this bitch started! Baby Yoda OG from Cannabismo. Donna's frying up some steaks and onions, or onions and steaks, however you want to say it, eh? And, um, she's got some vegetables over here. They're the Japanese kind, she said. Donna, what's in this Japanese kind? Seaweed and stuff? No. Or is that what the Chinese have? Is it the Chinese or Japanese that eat the seaweed? Well, I don't want no fucking seaweed. Is, it, is this normal vegetables? Yeah. Okay, those are normal vegetables that are called Japanese vegetables. It's a Japanese mix. It's a Japanese mix. But it's the same kind of vegetables as we eat here in Canada. Eh? There's carrots and all kinds of shit in there. You can see. You can see what the fuck is in there. You got eyes. Eh? Anyway, we're going to have some vegetables, and we're going to have some steaks. Actually, we're going to have a Japanese mix of vegetables. Why is it called a Japanese mix, Donna? It's, it's not from Japan? Um, you know when they make, like, stir-fries and stuff like that? Mm. Like, different things like that? So this is the kind that would be used in a Japanese stir-fry? Or with steaks? Or with chicken? Okay, Donna's making shit up. No, no. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, so yeah, we're having steak and Japanese mixed vegetables. Is that what it's called? Japanese mixed vegetables? Okay, enough about the fucking vegetables. Uh, we were at Walmart today. We got some Fruit Loops. And that's for Saturday. Because I'm doing the diet thing right now. And yeah, Saturday is going to be break day. And that's what this is for. Fruit Loops for break day, eh? And, yeah. Um, here's Donna. Hi. She was eating Honey Nut Cheerios. Looks like she didn't save me anything. You fucking Cheerio hog! <laughs> anyway, we were at, uh, we were at Walmart. That's where we got the Fruit Loops. I don't know if I said that. Anyway, we went to Walmart to get some odds and ends, and we were leaving Walmart, and Donna's phone started to ring as we were pulling out of Walmart, and it was the Timmins police. 
and they were over here at our house. And the, the officer told Donna, yeah, the police officer told Donna he had two subpoenas for her. She had to go to court. So we drove home to meet the officer here and see what was going on with the subpoenas, eh? We got here, the cop handed Donna her subpoena, and then he looked at me and said, are you Edward Dampier? And I said, yeah. And he had one for me too, he handed me one too. Fuck! Eh? Now I have to go to court. We both have to go to court. Cocksucker! Eh? I don't have time for this shit. Anyway, when Donna's done cooking the steaks and the Japanese style vegetables or Japanese vegetables or Japanese, uh, fuck! Hey, eh? what are you? What is it called? Japanese mix. When Donna's done the steak and the Japanese mix of vegetables. We will talk about why we got subpoenaed. Right, Donna? Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna get in a bong toke. Donna was gonna clean my bong, but we were talking to the police officer and then when we just came in after and I started the show and well she hadn't had time yet so it looks like dehydrated piss still and yeah hey way she goes did I say today was Thursday I, I, I hope so today's Thursday if that fucking matters for anything I don't know what are you doing over there, Donna? Cutting some cheese. Cutting some cheese. I thought I heard a sound. Yeah. <laughs> Donna likes to cut the cheese. Um, bloop. Um, yeah, so when Donna's done the steaks, we'll talk about why we got subpoenaed. Why we gotta go to court. So, yeah, hey, okay. when the steak's done. We'll meet you cocksuckers here at the table, eh? Steaks are done. The Japanese vegetables are done. Or, sorry, the Japanese mix of vegetables. Got some cucumbers, cheese, Carrots. Donna's got the same shit. What you got going on on the edge there, Donna? What do I mean on the edge? You're messy. Oh, it's because of... Never mind. You're messy. No, it just went like that. <laughs> got some steak sauce. The cheap selection kind, eh, Donna? <laughs> Water bottle each. And got some bong tokes ready to go. Got one in there. Baby Yoda OG to be exact. And I think that's everything. I'm going to stick you guys on the counter. And you need anything from in here, Donna? No. Are you sure, Donna? Mm -hmm. I'm not going to sit down and you're going to say, Oh, can you get up and get this? Huh? No. No? You sure? Okay, yeah. good. I'm coming to sit down.
Well, all right now. <laughs> anyway, um, before I taste my food here, I'm going to get in a supper toke because I want to taste all the flavors, okay? Today's diet day number five. And we've upgraded from tuna sandwiches to steak. And lots of vegetables. And lots of vegetables. We went from salad to lots of vegetables. <laughs> okay. You can start talking if you want. It's all quiet in here. I was just thinking. Well, think out loud. Um, I don't know. This, this thing that we have to do is uh, going to be interesting. Yep, it's going to be. So what happened is in the summertime, there was a dickweed. I can't tell you guys his name because I guess there's rules on that shit. You just can't slander somebody, even though it's not slander, it's fucking real, but they call it slander, so I we'll call him Mr. Dickweed, okay? So anyway, in the summertime, Mr. Dickweed came to my front window and he had his cell phone. And he was taking pictures of Donna. Maybe video, I don't know what it was, but he was holding the cell phone up. Well, you tell that part, because I didn't see that part. You tell that part. I was sitting on the love seat, doing something on my phone, and I just happened to look up, and he was... Oh my fuck, this is a good steak. Coming, walking towards, like he was coming up in the yard. He was already in the yard, and he was coming closer to the window, and he had his phone like this. So I don't know if he was doing pictures or video, and then I called for you. Yeah. And then, um, as I called for you, he's now at the back of the car taking pictures or video of the license plate. And then, and he was in the middle of getting dressed, so it wasn't like you could just, you know, and then you- Yeah, I just got out of the shower. And then you can continue because I didn't. Okay, so here's my version. I just got out of the shower. I was just putting on my GoPro because I usually wear my GoPro around in case something happens. I record everything. Okay, some of you guys know that. If you're new to the channel, well, now you know. Okay, so anyway, I'm just putting on my harness and twisting on the GoPro, you know, and she screamed. So I went running into the living room, was like, what the fuck? And she was telling me that there was a dickweed at the window taking pictures or videoing her or whatever with the cell phone. And then she said he went over to the back of the car and was taking pictures or video of her license plate. So I looked out the window and the dickweed was standing on the street and he put his hands in the air like this and he said to me come on and so I looked at him and I said okay and I pressed record on my fucking GoPro and I walked outside because well I had enough of this guy I was gonna fucking give it to him right and by the time I got out the fucking door instead of being on the street here ready to fight because he's the one calling me on he ran two or three fucking houses up that fucking way and he stood up there throwing all these threats at me and stuff like saying he was going to do this and do that and whatever and, but yeah, he wouldn't come and do it he was just saying he was going to do it because well I don't know why okay anyway um so after that you guys already know that I upload everything to YouTube. If you guys want to see the video, give me the thing and I'll show them. Well, anyway. I guess the 
I guess the cops seen my video and they don't like that dickweed at all because he's a real troublemaker I guess here in Timmins I can't say his name but anyway the cops seen my video and you can tell you can tell the rest because you know more about it than I do what do I know well remember the cop said after he watched my video what we said happened to that guy oh yeah that he got charged yeah and um, so we that, had no idea yeah we didn't even know he got charged here's the video you can go back um, this only has that's that's the name of the video if you go check it out like this week or something it'll still be up but it, well, it'll still be up in a couple weeks too but what I'm what I'm saying is I'm gonna I'm, I'm tagging retagging and renaming some old videos and yeah that video might have a different name in a week or two so if you want to see it it's called that go check it out so what happens in here uh, that okay you went blurry it's focused now so anyway in here it shows only the part from after he called me on and I pressed record and I went out the fucking door and that's all that's on the video but I went out I went outside and after he ran up and was up in that yard over there he kept on throwing threats at me and stuff and I put my hands in the air and I said what Hey, I stone cold Steve Austin him. Hey, is that what you call it? Mm -hmm. I kept saying what, trying to get him like, you know, to come back and whatever. But he just sat over there and kept mouthing off like a little bitch. And well, I don't want to talk about it anymore. I prefer you guys to go and watch the video for yourself, and then that way you know what what happened. So anyway, I, I guess this guy ended up getting charged. We didn't know about it. And a, a cop told us, how long ago, like a month or two ago? Um, was it with the egging? It might have been when the egging happened in the front. That we found out. Yeah, the, the, the police officer came here after the egging because it was the same dickweed that egged the house that you see in the video run away. Um, the police officer, what was I saying? Oh yeah, the police officer told us that he apparently got charged for what happened in that video. And we didn't know. So anyway, uh, I don't know what this dick we got himself into, but we have to look for it. apparently because he got into shit with us before, we have to go to court because of whatever he got himself in trouble for. As like what do we even have to do? It says, um... I'll show you guys the papers, but Donna has to hide the name of the dickweed. So you, you're just, you're just, um... Just what? Okay, we'll just go like this. The top of the paper says, subpoena to a witness. And... Ontario Court of Justice has my name first and last, my address, you guys already know it. And then it has the dickweed's name and his address. And I'm gonna I'm gonna fold I'm gonna fold the part that has what I just told you with the dickweed's name and my address and stuff. You guys already know my address, it's in the description below. I don't give a fuck about my address. Oh here it is anyways, my address is still gonna come up. So but it, it has my name on this side plus my address again and my postal code and it has this guy's address and his fucking name and I don't want to show you guys that because I don't know if I can so I'm gonna come around and show you guys what I got the lower half of what I got and you guys could pause your screen and read it yourself I don't know how. Hang on, let me let me bring you guys up to the board. It's better that way. So we just got these today. Um, so yeah, read away. And then yeah, if you notice right there, uttering threats, cause death or bodily harm, 
and failing to comply with probation order or whatever. That has to do with the video where he was mouthing off to me and I don't know anything about his probation. I guess maybe he was on probation. I don't know. But, yeah. That's what we got today. And we got to go to court now. Eh? So, yeah, pause your screen if you need to sound out words like the. Eh? Here you go, Donna. And, oh, was it, wasn't there a second paper? What's that little paper say? Where'd you go with that? Oh, this was the, um, that was, like, that's from the police. Yeah, this was from the police. They were going to leave that in the mailbox if, well, they did leave it in the mailbox because they weren't sure if we were going to be home in, in time to get the subpoena papers and, yeah. So there's that, too. And, yeah! Now you guys know the story. That's what happened to us today. A dickweed came here in the summertime and thought he was tough. He called me on. I went outside to throw him a beating. I was going to toss him a real good beating, too. And he ran up the street, decided he wanted to throw threats this way. I guess he got charged for it. We just found out about it when the egging happened. And... I don't know what he got himself into now, but apparently we got to go as witnesses because I don't know why. I guess because he caused trouble here before. I'm guessing. I, I don't know. I. I don't know. Not, I'm new to this stuff. Yeah, we, we've never done court. No. I never had to go to court before because somebody got himself charged by getting himself and shit without me saying anything and does that even make sense i don't even know how to make you know what i mean he got in trouble because of my video but that was his own fault it wasn't my fault <laughs> it's not my fault and i don't know what he did afterwards i, I don't know and now now we're stuck doing this. Yeah, now we're stuck doing this shit. What the fuck? And I don't really remember what I was talking about. Do you? I forget. <laughs> I forget mm -hmm. too. Anyway, bottom line is you guys know what's going on. And yeah, I've never had to go to court before. So I don't know what the fuck. I don't know. I really don't. I don't even have anybody to ask. I've never had somebody get in trouble on one of my videos before and then go and get themselves into more trouble and then we had to go to court. Like, I, I don't even, you know what I mean? I don't know what the fuck's going on. It's fucked. I just wanted to go shopping. Mm hmm. Anyway. Well, we'll talk about. That's what happened here today. We were going shopping and we, to, we got to Walmart. After we left Walmart, we had to come home because the cop was waiting here for that. Anyway, go check out the old video, the one I showed you guys, and you can see yourself. Some of you guys might even know that person. I don't know that person personally. I just know them as a dickweed from running around in my neighborhood and being a bitch. Eh? That's all. And now, also, I have to now cancel my hospital appointment. Yeah, she had to do her dental thing to get her teeth taken out. And there's no fucking way I'm going to court with no top teeth. Like, that's not <laughs> happening. So, like, you see how much fucking, like, I don't even know. Somebody gets their self, somebody's just stupid, and... 
we have to go and cancel our shit and stuff like that. Yeah. So now my teeth are going to have to wait till like April now. Yeah. It's fucked here in Timmins. <laughs> it's so long, eh? I, I, don't under, I don't understand. Like... I don't know. Whatever. It's very confusing. It's confusing here. If the police charged him for what they seen in one of my videos, shouldn't they tell me like when it happens and not way after the fact? Right? Mm-hmm. Because they didn't tell us till when the egging happened, how long is the egging after that incident, when that thing happened? Um, well, one thing happened in September, October, November, the beginning of November. How long was that? Well, all of October is a month, September, October, two months. Yeah, so we didn't know till two months later that the guy even got charged. We didn't know. But I don't understand. We didn't even know he was going to get charged. Like we. Nobody said anything to us. Yeah, like we didn't. Nothing. An officer came here after the egging and said, uh, didn't you know that person was charged for threatening you before? And I said, no, I didn't <laughs> ask for him to be charged for threatening me or anything like that. And he said, no, it's because they seen the video and apparently he got charged for fucking, uh, well, whatever you guys see in the video, mouth it off and say what he said. I don't even remember. Some kind of bitch words, eh? Charlie. Well, anyway, Charlie, stop it. Anyway, so they end up charging him. They told us about two months later and that was in October, you said, right? When they told us that he got charged? The beginning of November. The beginning of November. Okay, so two months after the, the thing, November, December, January, February. Yeah, so it's February now. Now, now it's a court thing. Yeah, I, that's what I don't understand. <laughs> I don't know. Anyway, if we find out any more, Donna's going to call and find out what the fuck's going on, like... And I don't know. Because we're, we're clueless. I, maybe he did something and... Like, it says we're being called as witnesses for something, and I don't I don't know what he did somewhere, and... We're just... I, I guess we're just going to say what happened around here, but nothing really happened. Everything that happened here, you've seen in the video. Yeah. The video speaks for itself. All you have to do is press play. I don't need to talk. But apparently I got to go there and talk. I don't know why. Well, the police officer said to call whatever and they'll give me all the information, so. So she's going to get some information. Probably tomorrow. So is she hey, tomorrow? Yeah, I'm going to call in the morning. She's going to call in the morning and find out what's going on and We'll let you guys know, because we don't even fucking know. I don't even know this dickweed. I just know he's a dickweed, eh? If you, guys, if you guys go back and watch the video, you guys might know that dickweed if you're from Timmins. I don't know. Anyway, I'm going to go and fill up, or clean up my bowl so I can fill it back up. And Donna, you can keep on chatting. I was going to say, maybe I should... Uh be watching Law and Order. Yeah. Watch the Law and Order and then we'll know what to do. Yeah. I guess I can't wear my toque de cord, eh? No, you can't wear your toque. You gotta dress decent, I guess. Like, I don't even know what I'm supposed to do or say there, you know what I mean? Well, that's what I'm gonna call, because I don't know if this is about... Um, I need to know. And once I know, then we can know what the heck we're supposed to... Like, I don't got no answers for anybody's questions. All I know is Dickweed called me on. I was going to kick his ass. He ran away. He said whatever words are in the video, and then that's that. I don't even remember the words myself. 
and you guys can go check it out though. Mm, fuck dog. Are you hungry? Yeah. I didn't what? You gonna lick that? No. Can you make can you say Charlie a little piece? Because I forgot it. You forgot to give Charlie food. He has food. <laughs> I just forgot. You to forgot to give him steaks, now I gotta give him some of mine. I gotta give you some of my steak, Charlie. <laughs> just a little I'll give him some of the gravy stuff. I always save Charlie something. You know what I forgot to do? I forgot to check check the time on the camera. I don't even know how long we've been talking. <laughs> this steak's really good. I didn't even use steak sauce. Another few minutes. That's because I made the gravy myself. Yeah. I did. I made it. You're a you're lie. You lie. You didn't make it. <laughs> so? Huh? What else are we gonna talk about? See originally we were just gonna talk about what we were buying when we went shopping, you know? <laughs> but we didn't really go shopping because after we left Walmart, the police were here calling us to come here so he can give us those papers. Yeah, so then we had to wait and do that. It wasn't like, oh, here and buy. We were outside for like a little bit. And then, and then I had to continue on our way. I feel guilty. But I didn't even do nothing. Guilty of what? I don't know. I never had to go to court before. I feel like I did something. Well, we didn't do anything. We were just living our lives. <laughs> yeah. We were just living our lives. <laughs> Here, Charlie. Piece of steak. Holy jeez. What? Yeah, we were just living our lives. We were just, you know, minding our own business, doing our own thing, and somebody wanted to be pretend they were Peter Parker. <laughs> <laughs> Peter Parker? Isn't, yeah. What do you mean by that? Isn't that the photographer? Spider-Man? Yeah. Oh, yeah, well, but he was taking pictures in the house and stuff. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's true. If that dickweed wasn't taking pictures into the house here at the car, I wouldn't have had to go outside to chase him away, and he wouldn't have ended up on video yelling aimless threats at me. Hey? Okay? <laughs> Want some vegetables? No, I had enough vegetables. How come you're not eating them? I had a couple. You I, barely touched I, the Japanese mags. I'm not Japanese. It doesn't matter. I'm Canadian, so I eat the steak. Okay, there's there's the peas and the broccoli and the um, Here, look, here's beans. A, here's a pea. And the water chestnuts. Here's a pea like Buddy's brain, eh? What? Was it funny? No, I hate when I get a thought in my head. Why? You don't like having thoughts in your head? No, well, it's not that. It's just kind of something like, uh... It's kind of something like, uh... I don't know. I'll figure it out. She'll figure it out. <laughs> What? A gravy carrot. Mmm. 
something? No, I can't eat any more vegetables. I'm all vegetable dose. Yeah, me too. I'm all vegetable out. I don't want the vegetables. <laughs> <laughs> I'm serious, I don't want the vegetables. Okay, yeah. <laughs> okay. So anyway, yeah, we'll keep you guys updated. Donna's going to call tomorrow and find out what she can find out and find out why we have to go to court because we don't even know other than what we know, but we don't know why we have to go there, eh? That makes sense? Yeah. I hope so. Tomorrow's Friday, yay! Tomorrow's Friday. I don't know what we're doing tomorrow. Today's day five of the diet, so tomorrow's day six. It'll be another <laughs> struggle. <laughs> well, actually today wasn't too bad because I got steak. I like steak, eh? I don't like the vegetables. Nothing. Okay. Anything else to talk about? Guess not, eh? We were gonna go shopping and do like an unbagging or something, but not now, eh? Eddie, stop doing that. Stop doing what? That! You're pushing on the table and the leg is gonna bust. I can see it moving. <laughs> <laughs> well, I don't know why he's doing that. Because <laughs> <laughs> you're going like, you're really like that, except you're doing it really hard. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't even notice. You're doing like fucking push ups while you're talking. You're just like. Okay, don't do that. You're, that leg's gonna come off over there. Look, it's not gonna come off. It's a strong table. <laughs> the fuck is wrong with you? The tables are only so strong. Yeah, well, fucking take me to court. Eh? <laughs> 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 Stop doing why, why that! Why is the why is the <laughs> why why is the guy that was peeking in our house taking us to court? I don't know. <laughs> I don't understand that. Can you can you let him out? Yeah. <laughs> I don't know why. I don't think it's. Huh? I don't think it's that person specifically taking. I'm not. I don't understand the whole fucking thing. I really don't. I need to. Speak well, it's his to fault. I have to go to court. I need to speak to. Uh, I didn't make it so I had to go to fucking court. I need to speak to a lawyer. Fuck! Hey. Yeah, I want my attorney. Do I need one? No. Are you sure? Yeah. I just know that, like, you have to go. Like, we cannot not go because then we'll get put in jail. Well, I'm going to go. I just don't know why. I think it's why a, he, the we, guy would be making me have to go when he's the troublemaker. So I, I, I don't really know that part. Of it. It's, it's kind of, I don't know. I've never, I don't understand it. <laughs> I don't know how it works. I need to find somebody that works in the courts. <laughs> need to find a court friend. I don't know. I need to move out of Timmins. People here are fucked. So you're telling me if we lived in a different fucking place right now, like a different city, we'd have to travel up here for this? Maybe, I don't know. Fuck. <laughs> anyway, yeah. I'm gonna get in my road toke. If you have any final words, go ahead. If somebody knows something about the courts, call I'm going to come to your house, <laughs> videotape your wife, and then I'm going to take you to court. But I don't know. Oh, then I'm, first I'm going to threaten you. <laughs> From way the fuck over there. 
No, I think it has to do with, like... No, I know. He got himself in trouble and... Maybe it's like we his probably character. Came, we probably came up in the list of people he's fucked with in the last year or something. And I don't know. I don't know. I just what know we have to answer. Hmm. Or say or something. We have... I guess we have to answer some questions because we're a witness to... <laughs> we witness something, so we have to answer questions. Of some sort. Donna's a witness to stuff. I really don't. She's a witness. So are you. No. <laughs> Just kidding. Witness to what though? To my own video? To like. I'm a witness to my own video. To like the events that took place. Like, you know, like. I don't know of any events. I just know the event on there. Well, maybe that's. What and that he's a dickweed. Question. Maybe his lawyer's saying it never fucking happened. Well, I got a video. Well, that's how he got charged. They seen the video. Well, I okay. I don't. You guys know. can go check out the video. <laughs> okay, listen. Everybody, watch the video, and then leave a comment. If you know something about the court system. No, just leave a comment anyway. Just if you want to leave a comment. <laughs> yeah, I'm not. I don't understand it. I didn't take it. I need to find somebody that took law. That takes taking law. Yeah, I never took law. I, I took weeds, eh? Fuck's sake. And, and obviously the police officer couldn't answer anything because he told us we'd have to call the the, uh, the crown. Yeah, because we didn't know why we had to go to court. and obviously he, didn't, he, didn't know. he didn't know nothing either, really, just other than... He's the one that delivers the papers, I guess. Yeah. He's the paper guy, the paper boy, the delivery guy. So I guess it would be the crown that needs us. Because I didn't... I don't know! <laughs> I'm, I'm getting a little bit anxious about this. Let's not talk about Do I have this. to comb my hair sideways? Oh, for fuck's sakes, don't you dare. Well, maybe I have to comb it sideways, like Clark Kent. Eh? Remember how Christopher Reeves used to comb his hair in the old Superman movies? Remember that? Don't. I should just let it. No, you look like a fucking freak. <laughs> <laughs> Long hair all fucking combed over like this. No. <laughs> I don't own a tie. Uh, I think you have to have... wear a tie. No, I hope not because I don't got one. You just have to dress like how you would normally dress, except like, you know, decent. I got a pocket watch. <laughs> I don't think they care. <laughs> No, but I don't got a tie. I think just, you know, pants and a shirt would do. Like my Pink Floyd shirt? <laughs> no? <laughs> I don't think so. So I gotta put on like my Christmas shirt? My cardigan? Maybe. I, I don't know. I don't know. Ah! Eh? Hey? I really don't. I don't know. Okay, I'm gonna give him a road toke. I see we got some new subscribers. Cigarette holder to you. I see we got some old subscribers. Cigarette holder to you guys. I see there's people watching that aren't subscribed. But you should subscribe, then... Well, you can keep up with the court shit now. Eh? Hey? But... Even without that, we upload something every single day, and if you're ever bored, you can come over here and see what we're doing, eh? And, yeah, so cigarette holder to you guys. Hit subscribe. Seriously, hit subscribe. Okay, if you have any words, go ahead. Not really. I, I, I'm glad it's going to be um, warm. It was fucking uh, minus, what was it this morning? Fuck, it was cold. Yeah, it was cold this morning. I was up early as fuck and... Oh, it's, it feels like minus. She was sleeping and I would do my bong tokes over there in the kitchen because I was tagging today's video for you guys. And I was blowing my smoke out the back door and... 
I think my smoke was freezing and hitting the ground. <laughs> Any, no, it's like I was blowing just ice out and it was hitting the ground. It's, a, it's only going to minus 17 tonight, which is good because it was like minus 34 or something this morning. But anyways, look at this. Zero on Friday, okay? Yeah. Four on Saturday, three on Sunday, and zero on Monday. Huh. Well. Well now, Donna. Um. Can you pass me those subpoenas for a minute? You can keep talking. Uh, I don't know. I was just saying the weather's supposed to be uh, nice. Hey! Look! The subpoenas are my cock! Hey, Donna! You wanna get subpoenaed? No. <laughs> You've been subpoenaed! <laughs> oh, fuck! I had a subpoenaed cock. <laughs> okay. I think that's all we got. We're gonna fuck off out of here. Smoke some more weeds. Probably not look for anything else to munch on, can we? Not really. No. Smoke some more weeds. Watch some YouTube videos and um. Keep on smoking weeds. <laughs> so until tomorrow, like, subscribe, and fuck off.